to be a cancer survivor and to thrive has led me to appreciate for many things that I hadn't thought about prior to the cancer, loved ones, relationships, and it has allowed me to be more hopeful, to be able to sit here and be able to share the experience. Having a cancer, it's like there's no hope if we heard about cancer. No, there's always hope. It is important to have a survivorship group to offer parents who have their children with cancer, have someone to rely to, support them, and know that they're not alone. I think it's important for us survivors to meet, to talk about our experiences and not keep it inside. Especially with the our Samoan people, our Polynesian people, they're kind of shy or probably they want people to know that they have cancer. Just being here tonight and kind of helped me to uh, to just move forward with it because sometimes you just hold on to those experiences and the trials that you go through. Because everyone's different and everyone's go through cancer differently. It's important to talk about it so that other people might share the same struggles that you go through with having cancer and surviving it. In saying how important this group would be for cancer survivors, survivors, I see it as being an opportunity for family members, friends, and the entire community actually to come to understand, to know, and to dispel some of the myths about cancer. And it's really important that everybody step forward, come and be comfortable and just a reason to come together and fellowship. I can't imagine a better place to do it than to come to these groups. Over the years, the Nalai Peni Pomele Cancer Foundation has provided financial support, community support, and recently a cancer support group. We are honored to be working with the Department of Health in providing support for our local cancer survivors. The Thrivers Group is a cancer support group for cancer patients, cancer survivors, and anyone that has been affected by cancer here in American Samoa. We have various fellowship activities such as gardening, painting, and a bunch of outreach services. For more information on the Thrivers Group and where to meet, please follow us on Facebook at the Department of Health American Samoa Comprehensive Cancer Control Program or give us a call at 699-5483. Hope to see you there.